I've implemented a new routine and I think it's probably the best right now as a Trinomir player. And that routine is, before every single session, I don't have the right to play a game of League of Legends unless I have first watched and studied a lot game. So who is Lot? Lot, he's a pro player. He plays in French Division 1 actually. Uh, he comes from Turkey and in solo queue he really likes to play Trinomir, even if he's never playing it in competitive. And right now he's playing at 1300 LP and he's playing Trinomir with a 70% win rate and he's really insane at it so now i decided to study him because i know how rangers play i know how bokap ule play but i still don't know how this guy plays so i go into my client i type chance dot hashtag lot and then even if he doesn't stream or create content i find his game through the client and review them on my little notebook right here and once i did that and i learned something i go into the game and now i can work with intention so of course you probably don't have to do it with him you can do it with me you can watch my content but really watch it and analyze it before going into your session uh, but it's going to give you intention and go it's going to give you new ways to see the champion or the game so because it's the best at doing trends and i'm probably like top three or four right now at doing it in europe well i'm watching him and i'm learning from him and you can do it by learning from anyone who's better than you basically so you're gonna see my mindset kind of shifted i'm now really rarely playing for the freeze and the very very slow push etc which i used to do a lot uh, now i'm constantly applying pressure constantly looking for for these trades under turret and having prior top lane um the idea is if you have a good position already you don't have to go crazy to try to have a better future one like if the position is good right now keep it you know like let's say you're on the map you have 1500 gold you could base for an item and then maybe with that item you would have a good position in the next fight well if you already have a good position and this item is not going to completely change your approach of the fight like just stay there and keep farming and keep advancing etc so you're gonna see slowly my my play they shift a bit i hope you enjoyed that video i hope you enjoyed that game thank you for being here much love I have a new routine before my gaming sessions uh and that i review one lot game lot is the best renomer player in europe and arguably in the world right now Okay, I can explain why I'm actually going Dishal into Orn. Well, I can surprise you already. He's gonna proc it a lot because you often get hit by something and also an enemy jungler is kindred. So if I trade too much HP and stay low, I can expect her coming, trying to get fed. And I don't think my Brent wants to come too much early at least. And I should though. I should consider top. Whenever he's pathing back to top lane, I, I I need to ping him because well he has the damage for Orn. Yeah, we need Trace to cover top side. Okay, he's actually pathing top. If he's pathing top, how do I want to play the wave? I guess maybe I can crash. Okay, he's not pathing top. Uh. Thinking wave with three, but then I stay. I base too often after my wave three crash, and I don't keep my pressure. So let me get the push, but not too fast. Okay. Let's show on this last hit. Are you good? Are you good? I see everyone. I was reading the message. Uh, when he goes for this, yes, maybe. Oh, then it's a wave to crash. He pushed it a bit fast with that trade. I think it was worth it. See. Okay, we see Kindred in our jungle. I should have hit my E. But pulling the wave like this is really good. And if you can keep chunking him, maybe we can dive with Brent. Ah, oh, come on. 
mean stop hitting. If you want to support the channel, feel free to like and subscribe. Okay. I'm gonna just pretend that I base. See if he stays. Okay, well, he does have vision. It might be if I actually let the wave push to me. Brain can come after Scuttle. Oh, he's gonna contest bot, bot crap. Because it's, it's, uh, Kindred's mark. An ally has been slain. Okay, I want him to have to TP to fix the wave. That's my whole objective right now. Or maybe I approach it a bit different. And I get his TP instant. Oh, he's staying. Into Oh, he stayed. Oh, shit. Oh, I played that so poorly. I eat so late, like I'm never supposed to die here. Like, I wanted to keep my E to... to get... Nah, that was, that was really bad by me. I mean, still, it's still pretty good overall, but could have been done way better. Yeah, I'm never supposed to stay here. Okay, I'm gonna try to do this more often, like actually perma push, perma push if I can, of course. Maintaining pressure, you get plates, you get perma prior for a jungler, you get them to miss a lot of CS, and can lead to a solo kill. I played that so poorly. Okay, he wants to play grubs, but I'm not gonna have. Not gonna have me ult, but I will have prior. Okay, we can go for it. Oh. Okay, not sure where Kindred is. So I'm gonna save my E for a bit. I 
Not sure what that was about. When he started, when he ulted, I thought that Kindred was coming, but... I guess not. Doesn't have TP. Can get this. Take my base. Okay. Let's think about it. I think maybe flashing in would have been a better call. I don't know. I don't know we're losing a lot mid. I don't get why Zerg didn't go mid though. I should have pinged it to her. Everyone was caught in the action. I could have gotten the plating. It's okay, I'm gonna get it later. Not sure if I have the time for this cutter. Can be risky. Kidris was running straight, yeah. We're not gonna trade HP for a bit. does have TP now though, so I think he had further base, does have my item. I mean I was thinking if I try to push it it's gonna TP top, but okay, didn't base. Yeah maybe I should have tried to push him into TPing or showing. Well I guess he will still end up having to TP though. Ah, oh, this is fine. I lose one minion on my base. Get all of these CS. And now he's gonna TP. If he doesn't, he's gonna lose plenty. Okay, that should be enough. Kindred can be coming top soon. I get two plates. They get vision. This is really good. I'm four plates. Uh, I have four plates to zero. I'm up 30 CS. I'm up one kill. Open XP. Ayo, yaha! You bro. Okay, second red.
Okay, very nice. Yeah, Lulu can go catch this wave and get T1 top. Should have probably pushed mid. Ah, uh, I guess both are fine. That's T1. Get next wave. Okay, what would Lot do in this situation? AP damage, AP damage. So I think he would do this, this, and then start working on that. By doing this, probably doesn't need magic resist as much as. Oh, 14 seconds, getting home guard. Oh. Mm, I think sending me both top and bot are good. I'm actually gonna go top. Okay. So now next target is Retent. Tier 2s, of course. I, am your worst I guess we're giving this Herald. I'm just gonna cure some vision. Make sure if they're on it or not. Kindred is here though. Up. I need to be careful because they probably have their eyes on heralds. Yeah, I'm just scaring Kindred away. I'm the one who needs to be scared, kind of. I mean, she's a bit nine though. I don't need to be scared, but I need to hold it. Okay, I can collapse on Jin once again. Or Kindred. Or Orn. Oh, I thought I thought that was the last third shot. My bad. Oopsie doopsie. I thought that was the last third shot coming. It's okay though. I still got my demolish proc. Get your one mid. Save me demolish. Your team has destroyed a turret. Play Drake. Wait, wait if you want to play this just a bit more for Zeri and Trist. Okay, Trist not coming. Are they from what? Oh, from Collector. From Collector and Red Buff. 
Okay, but is Tristana finally going there? She's going when Kindred finally arrived. Okay, it's a tragedy. I feel like Tristana could have came like an hour ago. It's my bad, shouldn't I hear? Give a shit down as well. And just like Tristana typed FF, she decided that she doesn't like the game. And now she's making it so we're not succeeding. We get tier 2 mid at least. Okay, probably dead. Could have played tier three. Good job. Please don't spend too much time here. We don't care about T3. It's a bit risky now. Yeah, let's get. Oh, bro, I hinted that so hard. It's one HP legit. Okay. Then I finish them off, most likely. Nice. Let's get out. I drop a pick on Nash. Push with that next wave. It's gonna be the same time as Zeri and my team. stop I really need not to die here if I die it might give them Nash
Okay, if they're not contesting Drake, we should just go for it. Zer is getting mid play. Nah, they're not allowed to do this. Just dies again. They can't, they can't do Nash. Why am I lagging? They might be on it, they might be on it. This is coming. Okay, they can. They can, they can. They have Lulu. All of them are dead, finally. What full lot to probably go full. And the FF. Nice, nice. 